Backcourt at 8 is your time right now. You may remember this story we did last year. A teacher at the Sequoia Deaf School, which is in Mesa, started an online fundraiser. She was trying to buy supplies for their teachers and students. Before that, she was actually paying out of her own pocket. Little did she know that some generous people were about to step up big time, including a man who donated ready thousands of dollars to build the brand new kitchen for the school. So fast forward, here we are a year later and the kitchen is complete. Elena is in Mesa this morning with a look at how this is something good and how it's going to help even students learn some valuable life skills. Good morning. Hey, good morning, guys. It's so nice to hear that our something good literally did something good here. We're inside Sequoia right now, and we're joined by Nicole, the very lady that was spearheading, you know, trying to get this done here. But what's really cool about this, guys, is that this is actually a surprise for some folks in here. But first, let's talk to Nicole real quick about, you know, the progress that we've made. I can't believe that, you know, um, do we know who this person is that donated? We do. He's a very generous donor. He wants to remain anonymous. Oh, okay. Um, but we are naming it after him. We getting okay. a plaque and everything. Okay, perfect. And so, we're hoping he'll be here for the ribbon ceremony. Okay, and when is that coming up? Um, hopefully in a week or two. Okay, hopefully so it's coming soon. up yes. soon, yes, because yes. it is the school year. Yes. And so, you guys, let's go ahead and walk towards uh, this big development here because we are surprising who exactly? We are surprising the Ramirez family. Alicia Ramirez is one of my students. Okay, so let's go ahead and walk our way there. I want you guys to take a look at this hallway. This is where the, you know, this surprise is going to be. Nicole, you want to show us the way? I will. Okay, Alicia and her family are going to follow us behind. And so we're going to let Nicole kind of do the the big debut hey guys all right let's take a look look at this we're gonna cook together what do you think oh you love it oh that's so exciting I can tell you're getting a little emotional about this how hard was it to get this all together and then kind of just see it in person now this has been something that we've been working on for years. Um, so it's really, really amazing to finally have it happen for the kiddos. Yeah, absolutely. So guys, I want you guys to take a look at this kitchen. Look how nice it is in here. Look at this countertop, bright light, a ton of room for the kids to learn all the basic necessities. So um, remind me how old Alicia is. Alicia, how old are you? Eight. You are eight. Okay, Alicia, I wanna ask you one question. How excited are you to use this kitchen? All right, I'm gonna to come to our interpreter here. So how about we go ahead and you take a walk around, Alicia. Yeah, go ahead and then perfect. So you could see that, look at this guys, this is brand new, thanks to that donor, Nicole. I wanna talk about again that ribbon opening and then kind of like what you guys are working towards for the future because I know you guys are still needing some supplies in here. Yes, we are looking for sponsors to get the appliances. The appliances are gonna even have a washer and dryer for our life skills class to be able to learn more life skills. Um, we're looking for a stove, a microwave, a dishwasher, we have a Donors Choose website for teachers to be able to get other supplies they need for the year and an Amazon wish list as well. So there's lots of things that we're looking for to get this year rolling. It's really exciting to have all these new things happening for the kids. Um, last year I got to teach cooking inside my classroom and I'm so excited that we're going to get to do it the right way now. Yeah, absolutely. <laughs> oh, I'm so glad this is happening for you guys. Thank you so much. And so again, they're going to have the ribbon uh, ceremony basically in a couple of weeks, but I'm going to end it with this. Alicia, you guys tell me one word that you're feeling right now when you see this new kitchen. Happy. Okay, that's it. Something good made Alicia and it's going to make the rest of the school happy. Back to you guys. Love it. That is awesome. And that is certainly something good. Elena, thank you so much. We love hearing about things like this happening in our community. Something good. So if you know someone or see a business, see a group doing something good, spreading kindness, we want to hear about it. It's super simple. Just go to azfamily.com slash something good. You'll see a nomination page there to fill out. Don't forget to include any photos or videos. You can always, always email me directly as well, traffles at azfamily.com. So we can share that good right here on the show.